And a Jesuit priest from Holland who has lived in Syria for most, almost 50 years says nothing will change unless the two camps trust each other. They talk, talk, talk. They meet dressed in their finest in good restaurants and upscale hotels. But I feel that what we're living through here is very far removed from how they live. If there is trust, then the negotiations will be productive. If there isn't, then they won't succeed, whether they're held in Geneva, Paris, Honolulu or London. If there is no trust, negotiations will achieve nothing. The faces of people you see in the streets are weak and yellow, their bodies are weakened and have lost their power, the strength has left their bodies. We want to eat and we want aid to come in, but also we want a way out, food does not solve the problem.